So I got this new t-shirt from my company. Uh, I usually just wear like a regular t-shirt and pants on a photo shoot. I never really had a, a professional uniform to wear. So I got this t-shirt. I don't know if you guys can see that. It has some FMP on it. And I got it just before, you know, what started to happen across the world. And uh, I never got a chance to wear it. So I'm gonna wear it for this video. <laughs> <sighs> What's going on guys? I hope you're staying happy and healthy today. All right, so I know that there's a lot of uncertainties uh, nowadays with this thing going on. And uh, a lot of people are very concerned about their well-being, their, uh, how they're gonna be living their lives for the next maybe couple months. And uh, I wanted to ease some of that stress today if I could. Especially for some creators that I know that are probably going through the same thing I am. And uh, there is one thing that I've come across that might actually help some of you guys. So uh, we're going to talk about that today. All right, passive income. What is it? Uh, what's the difference between active income and what are some examples of it? All right, passive income is basically income that you get without you having to do little or none effort at all. So that means like, if, uh, so I recently just opened a uh, an online shop so that enables me to put on my my products and my pictures and all that and all I have to do is just set it, set it up every single item with their set prices basically look make the basically make the product look presentable to the buyer and that's all I have to do so I'm working with a company called Find Out America. They're basically uh, b handling everything that has to do with shipping, handling, uh, customer problems, uh, anything like that so that I don't have to deal with all that. All I have to do is just post all my products up in the pictures and that's all I do. At the end of the month, I just uh, cash in whatever revenue I made at, at the end of the month. That I do take a commission, so I don't take all of the money I make because obviously they have to they have to create all the products, they have to uh, uh, get all the supplies for the canvases and all that. So, yeah, there there is a trade off, but it's for me it's worth it. I get um, fifty to seventy five percent of the profit, so that's pretty good. All right, so the difference between passive and active. Active is basically I have to do all of the work. So that means buying the supplies, making the canvases, uh, printing out the canvases, which is a whole ordeal by itself, um, making the shipping and handling, uh, ha uh, handling all the problems that uh, the customer might have with the products. Uh, all of that is stress that I don't want to deal with as a, as a creator. Some of you might be thinking like, ah, oh, that's the wheezy, uh, wheezy, that's the easy way out. And I'd be like, okay, yeah, it is. But for me, I would, I would rather not have to deal with uh, any of that logistic stuff and uh, just, you know, create art. And if the person likes the art, they like it. If they don't, they can just return it. Ooh, there's a big crane outside my window. That's cool. Benefits of living in Florida. <laughs> so for me, a, pa uh, a passive income is fine by me. I'll take a passive income uh, rather than an active any day. <laughs> uh, for logistic wise, I've made about $48 uh, in the past two days. So just knowing that uh, people are buying my products is <laughs> honestly enough payment for me because in the long run it'll be a lot more advertising that i actually don't have to deal with and that's technically also passive in another way um but if you guys uh, like this video and you have any more questions drop them down in the comments uh, i'll be happy to answer them for you uh but that's all for me if you guys like this video like subscribe See you later. Look at him just chilling there. You guys like the shaky camel collie?
shaky camera for the win. Yeah, little lizard. Okay, bye bye.